this is when I'm like introducing Wangeshi. But hey, she's <laughs> called Brenda, and she's you know she's into beauty, you know skincare. Our hashtag today was self care Friday, and of course you know to my little am too and I do more about this. Such an ending as this, as we're very analog. Now how she's digital. <laughs> Karibu sana Brenda. Yay. Thank you so much. Oh, thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You look beautiful thank too. Thank you very you much. Know, very very beautiful. Let's <laughs> tennis sana. So thank I want to go you. by your slogan already. Mm -hmm. So today we want to make some something very clear. Let's make one thing clear. Uh -huh. Yeah. Your skin. Absolutely. Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you yeah. so much for coming. Mm -hmm. So you're a mom, you're a therapist, skin therapist, you are a lawyer. Talk to us about how you're a lawyer dealing with this. Well, I'm a retired lawyer. Okay. So I quit the corporate world two years ago. Mm -hmm. And I always knew that when I quit the corporate world, I wanted to do something that's going to change lives. Mm -hmm. And I've always been very, very interested in beauty and fashion. Mm -hmm. But then beauty for me has a special meaning to me because mm -hmm. this is not just a about looking good and everything from the outside. I also wanted people to look good from the inside. Right. And I mean, the skin is the largest organ in our True. body, right? Mm -hmm. So I wanted to take care of that first. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so yeah, so I'm a skin legend, a beautypreneur, yeah. a mother. And there's something that I, I like to say. Yeah. I'm the descendant of royalty, you know. Oh, I wow. stand on the shoulders of all the queen mothers, Makeda, Nandi, Cleopatra, Nefertiti. And these are the uh -huh. secrets of yeah. the ancestors. So these are the <laughs> secrets of our queen mothers, yeah. you know. Yeah, nice. Yes, exactly. Yeah. And I'm like, you know, how wow. was the, you know, how was the transition, you know, from the corporate world and you getting into business? Did you have like, you know, some fears? What if you know this is something I want to do mm -hmm. that it doesn't work? Yeah, did did you question? I'm a second guess yourself. <laughs> definitely, mm -hmm. definitely. First of all, I spent 12 years in the corporate world. I was mm -hmm. working as a complaints, contracts, lawyer, everything mm -hmm. for 12 years, right? But it got to a place where I felt I had these gifts and something that I want to share the world with. Mm -hmm. And although I really enjoyed the corporate world, mm -hmm. it started to get boring because I was a desk lawyer. You know, from yeah. nine to five, I was doing the same thing. And I think the boredom is what really pushed me out. Mm -hmm. But to answer your question, I was absolutely scared. First mm -hmm. of all, I put all my life savings into the business. Like, so yeah. it, it, it was either going to make it or make it or make it or make yeah. it. That was my plan yeah. No other option. C &D, no other option. Yeah. So definitely, I was uh, definitely scared. And I think every entrepreneur, yeah. yes. But I'm enjoying it so far. Perfect. Let's yeah. talk about the name Untamed Beauty. What is that and what is that untaming that you need <laughs> to yeah. focus on so much that you have to name your company untamed beauty yes yeah, so i've always called myself a rebel okay. with a cause you know mm -hmm. and i feel like in the beauty industry we put women in a box you know so they have to look a certain way if you just google for instance beautiful women they almost all look the same and yeah. who, who, why put women in a box you know yeah. You look different from me. Absolutely. You're a beautiful African yeah. gorgeous queen. So are you. We all look different. Mm -hmm. We don't have to look the same. And so I wanted to bring in this concept where women are not being caged in a box yeah. and to be untamed and to just walk in their own beauty. So if you want your natural hair, you're beautiful. Nobody mm -hmm. should cage you. If I want my blonde wig, nobody should do cage you. me. Yeah. Your braids, just do you. So mm -hmm. it's all about women being free in their own skin and just feeling beautiful how they come. Mm -hmm. Yes. Wow. Yeah. So I'm like, when it comes to the range of products, you have um, what's the criteria that you use you know maybe perhaps when you're choosing you know what to bring in and is it from demand or you know what people like you know ask for yeah like what how do you know what to bring in when it comes to, you know at untamed beauty so at untamed beauty mm -hmm. customer is king and queen mm -hmm. so we'll listen to the customer <laughs> <laughs> like so that. definitely yeah. it's customer yeah. is king and queen mm -hmm. so maybe just to take you a little bit when we started i started with a cosmetic line mm -hmm. when i started so we had lipsticks we had eye palettes and all that mm -hmm. then covid happened all right yeah. and so obviously the beauty took a dive and a little mm -hmm. bit but of course the skincare was there mm -hmm. and people had sort of like you know the people had time to slow down and to take care of themselves yeah. and when we introduced the skincare 
it just shot up you know wow. it shot up mm -hmm. and to ask you there are those main things that people just use for a short while yeah. and people wanted more yeah. and so I said to concentrate on what people really needed in the market mm -hmm. and what people really wanted yeah. and so that's what I've been concentrating on but uh, going forward I'm sure you're gonna ask me we are planning <laughs> for much much more <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and we can't yeah. wait to see that yes. Yes. But yeah when I look at your products and, and as of course researching about yeah. what you bring into the table I discovered that you do vegan and it's yes. basically raw products that you get from the village of our great yes, aunties. Yes, Talk to us about yes. that. Why was it very important for you to get raw materials that are absolutely raw from the depths of the forest? You know, whatever <laughs> you are taking them. Why? Yeah. So going back, the yeah. secrets of ancestors. So my journey, what really why I came into this. My journey starts seven years ago. Mm -hmm. So I became a mother mm -hmm. and I was just very, very excited. Then my boy, like most mothers are gonna tell you, acne, I mean not acne, eczema happens. Yes. And eczema is just a nightmare to a small child. The scratching, the bleeding and mm -hmm. everything. By then I lived in the Netherlands and we literally tried every cream in the pharmacies, creams, medicine, nothing was working. And mm -hmm. I was desperate. So I make a call back home and an auntie says, Nini na wasumbua hapa? You know, <laughs> like shea butter. You know, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I know the shea yeah. butter. You know, yeah, to me a shea butter and everything. Yeah. And I'm like, okay, I need it as up when you're desperate, you know? Yeah. And so she sends the shea butter, okay? Mm -hmm. And another small thing that had all these little things you said. And I said, yeah. you know, you just wash your kid, da, 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 you know? Mm -hmm. And one week later, mm -hmm. the skin starts clearing. It's like peeling and yeah. everything. Mm -hmm. And in like three weeks, my kid's skin is, you know? Yeah, and normal. I thought, this is magic. This is yeah. magic. But now going back, yeah. I came to learn because of course that fascinated me. I was still in the corporate world. But then I realized there's so much knowledge and wisdom that is in the villages yeah. that we're not making use of. Mm -hmm. Our herbalists, they know it all. Not just the modern medicine, I'm not looking down on it. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so everything and the universe and God is so clever. Like all the medicine is in plants, you know, yeah. everything mm -hmm. is in the plants. And so I decided we will go back to the roots. And so, yeah, so we get it from the village. It's wild crafted and handmade with And love. it's true from the roots. From the roots, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> going back to the roots, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. my, so yeah. I think we can just say like, this has been very life changing for you. And yeah. a situation turned into a passion, no, yeah. a passion yeah. turned into was pushed by a situation. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yeah. to turn yeah. into a business yeah oh, that's very yeah. insightful though y yeah i'm like for guys who have sensitive skin so they shouldn't be you know um afraid or do you have consultation to know what kind of a product someone um will require or will need to use or it's it goes it works for any kind of skin so i try mm -hmm. to bring uh, products that are suitable for all kinds of skins, but mm -hmm. mostly the sensitive skin. But that does not mean that if you don't have sensitive skin, you cannot use it, you yeah, know? Yeah. But this is mainly tackling the sensitive skin, you okay. know? But also our clients and especially people with damaged skin, because th this is what we are really going into, because mm -hmm. the problem mostly is damaged skin, you yeah. know? Usually we tell them, your skin, you were not, your skin was not born sensitive. It's mm -hmm. something that's triggering it. It could be the environment. It could be the kind of food you eat. Yeah. It could be the weather it's it so could many be something things. Yeah, yeah maybe you're applying and something is reacting so mm -hmm. it wasn't you know it wasn't always like that yeah. and so it's all about repairing the oh skin using the roots the herbs I the love, everything i love yeah. the fact that we are just <laughs> sharing secrets and yes. secrets are not supposed to be said but la like <laughs> hapa, hapa, today right right we are doing that sharing the secrets with you do send in your questions whatever you want to ask wangeshi she's in studio but we gotta take a very short commercial break don't go anywhere Yes, you know, talking about beauty, this is the what you want to and and you all know how we do it. We're going to have a, have a model on st on set. You can't say stage. <laughs> but hey, <laughs> at this stage, stage, you need to get your skincare in check. I just <laughs> redeemed myself. We're going to have a model on um on set, and then the gorgeous Brenda is going to show us how to before the other one because otherwise if you're like me you'll do it just you know <laughs> and it's not supposed to be done like that so, yeah. so, so that you get to understand how it works and what happens darling come through yes 
Uh-huh. So she's your canvas now. Okay, mm. fantastic. And our place is very clean, by the way. <laughs> yes. Uh, you <laughs> do the cleaning. Yeah. All right. Okay, so we are going to start with the uh, vitamin C glue. Mm -hmm. Yes, and I'm going to explain later what this does. And this is a repair rose bomb oil. So this is a fantastic oil for guys with sensitive skin, for people with eczema, acne, everything, dry skin. This is the one. Mm -hmm. So the model here has already cleaned her face and also toned it. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do, the vitamin C, always remember, it should come before the rose bomb oil. And the reason is because it's serum, it's lighter than the oil, yes? Ah. And so just shake it kidogo, yeah? And then just mini kidogo, yes? And just apply, you know, just kidogo. Well, you can also put it on your palm and rub it, yeah? yeah. You can also do that. And then just do round, yeah? Ah. Round strokes, eh? See my dog, Daniel. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just make sure. Why? And, yeah. Why that motion? B because the motions also you want to massage the okay. whatever the skin, right. you know. Yes, okay. and to make sure that it goes inside very well. And then also our vitamin C is vegan and water based. So what happens? It's got a matte finish and it absorbs in only thirty seconds. So mm -hmm. most of the vitamin C's in the market, it takes sixty to one twenty seconds. Mm -hmm. Who has that time to waste, right? <laughs> so <laughs> convenience. Yes, convenience. the convenience. Yes. So you see, so and the best time to use the vitamin C, it's in the morning and in the evening. Mm -hmm. But if you just want to use it once, mm -hmm. use it in the morning. And this is the reason as to why mm -hmm. it protects you from sun damage. Those are mm -hmm. the free radicals without really getting to the technicalities. Yeah, yeah. the free radicals is just, uh, you know, some electron in metoroka kwa one of the atoms yeah yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Yes. and so the whole thing so what the vitamin c does it's like these electrons are looking for another atom to make it whole you know oh. and so in a destroy so th it is not going to be sun damage right yeah. but mm -hmm. also now the vitamin c it's got a number of things it's anti-aging you know so it also increases their collagen production yeah. it protects you from the sun damage also for pigmentation if you have like hyperpigmentation because probably your melanin but there's something i have to make clear yeah. melanin is beautiful it's what gives us our beautiful color yeah. you know yeah. but sometimes it goes overboard and so there's overproduction yeah? yeah so some of the places like your hyperpigmented this is also gonna sort it out ah. now this the second one sorry the rose bomb oil this is six organic oils. Wow. There's two herbs in it. So it's essential. Yes, it's essential oils, and okay. all of them are grade A. So there's tea tree oil, there's grapeseed oil, there's cinnamon bark. Cinnamon oh. bark was used over 5,000 uh, years ago by the ancient Egyptians mm. for fighting skin diseases, you know? So it's like six, there are two herbs here, and also there's some other you know yeah. those that's our secret because oh, yeah. we don't want people <laughs> <Of> <laughs> duplicating yeah. right really yes but now this one yes yeah, yeah. It's love. exactly <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah. Love. yes yeah. made with love yeah. and so this one especially for people who have damaged skin it's fantastic but also yeah. if you just just a tattoo like like this is the real magic this mm -hmm. is uh, literally you know if you think of your queen mothers they must have been using this yeah, you know yeah. so this is just gonna make you glow for the gods and that's a Ooh. promise you know it's really <laughs> someone <laughs> yeah, said i shouldn't yeah. take this just for granted the fact that uh, one mm. is a clear, yes. clear glass and ah, the other one is dark. Please yeah. talk to us about exactly, that. Exactly, exactly. So if you are going to buy vitamin C, you mm -hmm. know, of course I do hope you choose ours because it's really fantastic. Yeah. But always make sure when you're buying vitamin C, it's in a bottle like this one, a you know, a dark one, because what happens when it comes in touch with the sun rays, mm -hmm. it destroys all its components. Oh, so wow. then it destroys yeah. it. So if somebody's selling you vitamin C in, in a, a transparent bottle, yeah, just think about it or else just be very careful and always put it in a dark place. Yeah. And sometimes we forget, right? Yeah. So always make sure it's a dark opaque, you know, mm -hmm. kind of a bottle just to make sure that all its contents, yes, yeah. Yeah. exactly. But the other one, it's okay. You okay. can't, mm -hmm. exactly. So you people who yeah. are, you know, sorry, oh, have okay, questions yes. like, you know, after you do this, as yes. well, because normally everyone has something, a cream or a lotion they use for their faces. Yes. Yeah. Should they, like, can they still apply it on top or this is just enough for your face or, okay, like if you have sheer butter, yes. can they still use your sheer butter on top? 
like you I can mean, use a shea butter yeah. but mm -hmm. the rose balm oil is a moisturizer in itself oh, okay. yes it's a moisturizer in yeah. itself mm -hmm. the other thing that you can use now is the sunscreen if mm -hmm. you want okay. and then you can do your makeup after these okay. but if you have very damaged skin like you have the acne you have the eczema or you have flaky skin i would advise for the first three weeks just use the vitamin c mm -hmm. and the rose balm oil for just three weeks just to give it time to repair you mm -hmm. know and also if you have any questions whatsappers or inboxers Number. or Right, and because we can give you, we can advise you. Because sometimes you'll be using the wrong soap, yeah, yeah. you know, oh, yeah. or wrong toner, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. and but the right serum, uh, the right yes. serum, and then things are not working mm -hmm. as fast, you know. So you have to use everything right. But also, there's another thing to note: in our products, we don't use any ingredient we cannot pronounce, you know. <laughs> so if we cannot pronounce this, it's not in our ingredients, yeah. you know. So exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. Okay. Yes, and so our model, as you can see, she's ready so now she can put on her makeup mm -hmm. or she can just choose if she's in the house you know you can just choose you know and after three weeks anybody who has used it go to our website go to our ig page mm -hmm. you will see reviews of real people you know and these are our fastest moving mm -hmm. fastest moving yeah. yes and yes we have a giveaway Definitely, yeah. definitely, yes. So what are you giving them? What's that question that you would like them to answer so that they can win themselves some goodies? Now we want to talk about the shea butter. All right. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. So now, um, because of time now, yes. our shea butter is an Elotica shea butter. When people think about shea butter, they think of West African shea butter. Mm. Yeah. And that is fine, that is fine. But this is not just shea butter. Kuna shea butter and then there's a shea butter. This is like, like this is the Rolls Royce of shea butter. <laughs> okay. I yeah. Get it. So, yes. So this is great A. Mm -hmm. And it's also you can also cook with it. You can wow. spread it on your salad. It's organic. Yeah? It's organic mm -hmm. and it's food grade because they're different grades, right? Yeah. And so what happens? Ours is an elotica shea butter. If you go to our IG page, you'll also see a video how the women make it. Yeah. We have posted it there. But now this is the difference. If you have you Used, yeah mm -hmm. if you have used the West African shea butter it's very hard Nikama yes, it it's is. like a Maui oh, yeah. Yeah. you know no. it, exactly yeah. exactly yeah. and it also has a very strong smell which can put off a lot of people and most people don't know an elotica shea butter just that you know it only grows in Uganda and Sudan in two villages only mm. if you go wow. to the rest of the world Brazil Europe even America Nelotica shea butter is what they call the luxury shea butter and it's just next door, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. so it's more luxurious and this is the reason as to why. Can you see you don't need to melt it, you know, yeah. it just, yeah, so you don't have to melt it, you know, yeah. and then you see already it starts to moisturize your skin and the shea butter, it's rich in fatty acids, vitamin A and E, so it's also anti-aging, yeah. it treats also eczema, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. and all those skin diseases. But yeah. what are some of those ingredients that if I want to purchase, uh, like, like maybe a vitamin C. Yes. What's that ingredient I should look out for? Like if it misses, I shouldn't buy. Yes, definitely. So for the vitamin C first, always look at the percentage of the absorbic acid, which is the vitamin C. Mm. It should be between 10 to 30. Right. If it's 8% or 5, high you know, yeah. you might as well just, you know. Not. And then there's also something else, mm. filuric acid. At least it should be 0 0.5 to 1.7, yes. Yeah. If vitamin E is there, you'll see the ingredients. We always write them there. Yeah. Vitamin E is also important. And very, very important again, <laughs> always make sure the it's bottle, it's a dark it's bottle. A dark bottle. Yeah. Yes, always make sure of that. Oh, wow. Yes, yeah. yes. That, that has been amazing, but yeah. unfortunately, we've come to the end of our time. Yeah. So yeah. I don't know what people are going to answer so that they get the giveaway. Yes. Okay, yeah. so mm -hmm. maybe the question to ask, to ask, to ask. What can, where is our shea butter from? Yeah. And where does it come from? And why is it the Rolls Royce of shea butter? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice yes. Tell guys where they yeah. can find you on social media so that they can, you know, for consultation or... If they want to purchase. purchase. Okay, well, yeah. which camera am I looking at? That, oh, that one. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So you can find us on Untamed Beauty, KE, that's yeah. on Instagram and Facebook. You can also go to www.untamedbeauty.co.ke. We right now have seven stockists. You're going to find them on the homepage. Oh, wow. But just to name a few, there's Kipusa in Karen, uh, Harry Plaza. There's also West Mall. And also there's Jackie's Plaza in CBD. But we have a list of stockists on our homepage. So you're going to find them there. Okay. Yeah. Thank yeah. you so, so much. For much. You're welcome. Yeah. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you so much. <laughs> 
yeah. remember you know triple one triple four triple one is our sms line ukikimbia hapo mbio ya before to our facebook na social media yes. you might be the one to get a package <laughs> yeah. from brenda so that has been our show for today guess we'll be seeing you guys next week same time same place kikosi yetu ya friday na jonga ni 1:30 so watu wangu tupatane 10:30 reggae alafu 1:30 tuendelee na chat spot ama vipi yep. yaza kwa herini bye bye <laughs> bye bye <laughs>